Hello folks, um, welcome to the uh, sunny south and uh, Spartanburg, South Carolina. We had one of our unusual snows and it's still coming down, mostly ice now, but uh, we're expecting uh, five to uh, ten inches of snow and that's kind of unusual for us. Um, but at any rate, what I wanted to show you uh, was my, uh, was my, uh, were my um, permanent uh, kits that are outside. So uh, let me share my screen. And uh, you can see that this is a live view of my uh, dome. Uh, this dome is made by Home Depot, or it's probably made in China and retails at Home Depot for $59 and it sticks in a pole that sticks in a stand and uh, it's secured with bungee cord and so uh, I wanted to introduce you to the poor man's dome and underneath this though is the reason why I'm making this video are three telegizmos. Uh, my kits stay up year round 365 days a year uh, 24 hours a day and uh, I have uh, this is the uh, See, we're in our fifth year uh, since we downsized, and uh, I put these up. So I have uh, uh, purchased and updated my uh, uh, telegizmos. I keep them for about uh, three years, and then I'll replace them. But uh, uh, if you uh, take care of them and uh, tie them down real good, uh, your your gear will stay uh, moisture free, dry, and uh, ready to use as soon as you yank the covers off. And uh, I, I really can't say enough about uh, just how how efficient they are, and uh, they're lightweight. Uh, you can easily pull it off and put it back on. Uh, they make. Uh, by the way, I I, I don't represent uh, the company. I have no idea even where they're located. Uh, they were just recommended by a uh, fellow astronomer uh, from Northern California, and uh, I, I purchased one. I actually bought my first one when we lived in our other home that had zero view of the sky, and I had to put my telescope up uh, in my front yard on uh, the, the, uh, the, the a, little, a little concrete platform coming off of our front steps. And uh, I didn't want it when I had two or three clear sky nights. I really didn't want to take it in if I didn't have to. So I bought one of those covers. So I would go two, three nights, and of course then I would bring it in. I was also afraid somebody. We had a long, a, a large front yard all the way to the street. Uh, it was a good distance, and you could have stolen it, but uh, uh, I rolled the dice at that time but uh, now I'm in my backyard we have a, a, a gated a fenced in community and a gated community fenced in I mean backyard and, and it's locked and so uh, uh, I feel pretty comfortable and have surveillance cameras all over the place so uh, I mainly have them to view my kits when I image and to view the sky uh, when I image but they come in handy I, I suppose if uh, someone ever did come in our backyard it's constantly taking pictures of anything that moves. So, but at any rate, these 360 telegizmos can be purchased at this website. And uh, if you just Google telegizmo 365, uh, it's not the prettiest website, but uh, it's functional. And of course, companies like um, OPT, High Point Scientific, Woodland Hills, uh, just to mention a, a few, uh, all sell, uh, all sell these uh, gizmos, and so I highly recommend them. Uh, now we have a promise of clear skies for tomorrow night, and that being the case, I'll yank them and uh, fire things up, and I'll start imaging. Until then, I hope everybody has clear skies, and uh, and I also hope you keep your power. We're expected to lose ours sometime uh, today, just because of the effect of ice and 40 and 50 mile an hour gusts that are happening. So fingers crossed we don't. If we don't have power tomorrow, I will be imaging. Clear skies, guys.